never knew how to tell you. I would tell be able what? to talk about my Can life. You what? I, I ever loved a lot. I have a two yeah, arms. You want me to say it out loud? The equation goes something like this. One white mother plus one brown father divided by two different worlds equals a daughter. Give or take a decimal, the American dream turns out to be two half-white children, two full brown children, one small house in LA, four jobs divided by two high school educated parents. <laughs> The quality of life is high, though the means is low. The numbers vary from memory to memory, like three. Three times a week I clean houses in rich neighborhoods to make my way. Folding sheets is difficult. Every house has one rich white lady with two dozen sheets times four beds, which equals ten ways to fold the sheets so that they're perfect. Learning to fold sheets at least three to six ways means I can clean three to six houses a week, which equals rent, tortillas, and lettuce for the month. Going into one. One night a week, I go-go dance in a cage in a Hollywood nightclub. Ten dollars an hour, plus tips. I'm only 18 back then, and already I know the equation for lust. One bare ass and face gets a 20, one crotch drop burns a 50, one tongue licking cage bars while slowly gyrating hips equals I am the first in my family to go to college. Then there's five. Five times a day I prayed through my seven-year-old body that my father would lose his Spanish accent. I was convinced that if he did, he'd get a better job and we wouldn't be poor anymore. I was convinced he just wasn't trying hard enough to say signals instead of singles or video instead of video. Five times a day I sent my other prayers, my secret prayers, that I was thankful for looking the most white. In a family of coffee-colored children, how I prayed that my brown blood wouldn't seep through my white skin so that I could learn English, get an education, make my parents proud of half-white, half-brown accomplishment. Five times a day times seven days a week plus two small hands clenched together in fear and ignorance equals a lifetime of trying to make halves a whole. It's all in the numbers. These numbers that haunt my dreams make my past into single digits which have no common denominator. Just once, I'd like to write an equation for all the things I could never write about. For the three times my father took off work from three different jobs to see me in the school play. For the first and last time my sister told her abusive ex-husband that she didn't need him anymore. And meant it. For the hundreds of times I saw my parents laugh until the tears rolled down their cheeks. Even in a neighborhood of drugs and gangs. For that one moment I did see my father cry when I, the first in my family, received my college degree. I'm writing a formula for all the numbers that have fallen on me. Fifteen sunrises in three different states, eight million breaths and one kiss, 185 poems in eight years. I am writing an equation using the universal language of numbers to describe 10,000 ways that something can mean everything. It's just all in how you do the math.